Hey Blade Ops, um, <clears throat> for the first, uh, actually the second part of the marathon, the Tops Knives Marathon, we're going to do the Alert Series. Uh, we have a few of them here. Uh, the product codes on them are Alert 01, this is the XL01, XL03, and XL05. I'll pull them out, talk a little about each one, kind of compare them, and we're going to kick off the Tops Knives Marathon. There's going to be tons of knives in it, so check it out all day. So this is part two after the first part that was explaining what it was. This is the Alert One. Uh, it's got the sheath, a mini carabiner with neck lanyard, and it also comes with another beaded chain and the LED light. So that's pretty cool. Uh, the sheath is a form of hard plastic slash molded kydex, and it's got really good retention, so I'll pull that out. And this is the Alert One by Tops Knives. You can slip your finger in there and put your finger, your thumb up on the oversized jimping and you get some serious punch knife capabilities. You can also just hold it like a regular fixed blade and it has the straight Tanto, Tanto blade on that. Uh, the thickness on the metal there, on the steel there is 3 16 and blade length, uh, you're looking about an inch and a half and the overall length of the of the alert run from, from the tip to the bottom of the handle. Um, you're looking about three and five eighths overall. So and then the width, one inch. So that's the basic, the alert one with the keychain, uh, Top Snipes product code, alert ALRT01. So that's the 01. If we step up to the next one, uh, you're gonna be almost identical in most of the features, the Alert XL01, same sheath, same carabiner with neck chain. Um, this one just has a lanyard out the bottom. Uh, it doesn't have the LED light. Great retention on the sheath there. And two finger holes, and let me look. Those finger holes from the inside width are about uh, almost three quarters of an inch wide. I'd say more like five eighths from the center of the hole. Uh, same thickness, same width, it's got two holes. Overall length, uh, five and a quarter inches overall from the tip down to the bottom of the handle. Uh, this is actually gets a great grip for a fixed blade, or you can do the finger up there for the push, or you can do two fingers. But really like this, this is the XL01. If I was going for a little bit heavier task, I'd probably step up to this one. It could also be used as a pry bar because you a little bit longer leverage. So that's the XL01. And next we're going to go to the XL03. Uh, the difference here, it has a carabiner coming off the sheath. No neck chain, probably a little bit too heavy for a neck knife. And also has the lanyard. This one also comes with the micarta scales. Removable. So. Great retention. I'm assuming this has the same hole as the XL1 does underneath the scales. About 90% sure on that. So it does have the finger hole up front. You can hold it like that. And with the scales, surprisingly does give it a better grip. Uh, same length, it's got the five and a half inches. So the only difference between this one and this one, the XL01 and the XL03 are the scales. And this one doesn't have the neck chain, but it does have the carabiner. So there's the XL03. And last but not least, we're going to step up to the XL05. So this does have the chain, uh, smaller carabiner, and this sheath is Kydex. Most likely made by hand. Got the good little retention indentation there. Uh, has the scales and the lanyard. And the difference is, besides the sheath, this has almost a drop point blade. So as far as the length, same length, only difference has the drop point instead of the straight Tanto utility blade. You're looking at uh, just under two inches. If you measure all the way down to the bottom there, um, after it gets sharp, you're looking at two inches. So what do I think of the Alert Series overall? Uh, great little utility knives, neck knives, uh, backup series. Uh, not a bad choice for maybe your car, uh, your backup kit, or whatnot. So you, I would even use the Alert one, the the alert one for maybe a keychain um, or maybe a mini survival kit. So check it out, the alert series, and hope you enjoy the rest of the Tops Knives Marathon. We got a ton of good knives for you. Uh, the next one up is actually the Tops 
Idaho Arrowhead. So check it out. We'll be publishing it hopefully in the next hour or so. Blade Hops.